Oh, well, well. Here's Mama Bloom's brood. great day has arrived, the day of Sarah Bloom's wedding to Sydney. Let's look into the Bloom flat as Yetta says... Can I help you, Ma? Yetta, you'll please let me alone for a few minutes. I'm a nervous wretch. Did the flowers come? Well, they must be here. Uh-huh. In an hour, her sister's getting married, and they must be here. Look. All right. Look, and look right away, and hurry up. Wait a minute. Find out that the ice cream come. Yeah, the ice cream came. Is it the right kind? Sure, it's the right kind. I tasted it. Don't eat the ice cream, Yetta. Be short now. They're selling. She's getting dressed. Hey, you better start getting dressed yourself. Did my dress come? I don't know. Look and see if my dress came. Look and see if the flowers came and come back and tell me right away. Ma, Ma, is my veil here? Your veil is here. Where? Didn't you have to put it away? No, you put it away. Where did you put it? Look in the bottom drawer of the dresser in my room. Who's going to tie my tie? Can't you tie your own tie, Jake? A bow tie I can tie. Maybe I should wear a long tie. I got a nice black one. Did a tuxedo, you must wear a bow tie. Yes, I'll tie it. Uh, where's yet? Look in the bottom drawer of the dresser. Uh, no, no, the veil's in the bottom drawer of the dresser. The veil isn't there. Hey, yet to tie my tie. Did you find my veil? Yet to please tie my tie. Where's my veil? Ma, you put it away. It's in a bottom drawer someplace I remember instinctively. Distinctly. Sally, today don't come in. Think, Ma, where'd you put it? Who is tying my tie? I can't get dressed without a veil. Sarah, go in your room and wait one minute. We'll find the veil. Yetta, did the flowers come? I haven't had time to look. Should I go now? Jake, you go look. Yetta, find the veil. Hey, Jake, take a look also and see if my dress is here. All right, I'll look, but my Please time... Please go, Jake, and don't aggravate me, huh? Ma, Uncle Morris says the vest of Paul suit is too small. Did you find the veil? We are looking. I put it in the bottom drawer. The bottom drawer of what? Oh, hey, yeah. a couple of telegrams. Should I read them? The flowers are here. Well, how about these telegrams? Put them in border. The telegrams? Oh, oh the flowers. What will Uncle Morris do about his veil? Mommy, your dress is here. Did you take it out from the box? I'm trying to tie my tie. I've looked in every bottom drawer in the house and there's no veil. Uncle Morris says his vest... I know it's already, Jay. Well, here's your dress, Ma. I thought you didn't want sleeves in it. It's got sleeves. Let me take a look. Oi. Twenty-eight times I told them not to put in sleeves, so they put in long sleeves. Mama, Mama, the, the flowers are here. You can't wear a dress with sleeves. Oh, where's my veil, Mama? Mama? Why don't you tell her where her veil is? What time is it, Jake? You, uh, 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 you got 15 minutes yet. Who is tying my tie? Yet I take a razor blade and take out the sleeves from my dress. But what'll Morris do? He oh. can't get into the vest. Uh, should he go without a vest? He can't go without a vest. But how can he get into it? I don't care how he gets into it. He's got to get into it. I got so many troubles already, I can't be bothered with Morris' death. Yeah. Sarah, Sidney wants you on the phone. Tell Sidney he's got the whole rest of his life to talk to Sarah. He can't I'll talk, talk to, to him. Uh, he can't. Meanwhile, please find my veil. And then, Mama, maybe I should look for Jake, you know when it comes to finding things you're no good. You fix Morris' death. Yes, I'll please look for the veil, eh? Well, wait a minute till I tie Pa's tie. Yeah. He said he sent me a bridal bouquet. Ma, where'd you put it? Look in the kitchen, in the refrigeration. You mean ice bar? I don't care if you look in the stove as long as you find it. Yetta? Yetta? Yetta! What's the matter with that girl every minute I need and she's playing seek and hide? <laughs> I found the veil. Jake, where'd you find it? In the bottom drawer? No, yeah, no, no. It was in the linen closet. Who put it in the linen closet? The hired girl. She thought it was a lace curtain. Well, what time are the musicians supposed to be here? Half past five or sooner. What time is it now? Uh, wait a minute. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> My watch is in the other pants. Uh, yet to go and find out what time it is. Mama, still Morris has no vest. Ma, I can't find the bouquet. Ten minutes to six. 
swear with the musicians. You can't have a wedding with a saxophone. Jake, call up the musicians. Find out what's the matter. Here, Sally's right of okay. What'll I do with it? Take it into her room. Mama, who, who, who should I call up about the musicians? Call Abe Leibovitz. Abe Leibovitz? Abe Leibovitz is in the fish business. What's he got to do with musicians? Jake, call Abe Leibovitz. His son plays the violin. Oh, I see. All right. Uh, uh, Mama, uh, what's the number? Look it up in the telephone dictionary. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh, Ma, how do you spell uh, Leibovitz? Look up fish. Uh. Ma, how does the veil look? Put on your dress. Maybe I can tell. Gee, everybody looks swell. You ought to see Rosalie Feldman. Yet I don't waste time with the guests. Mama, I can't find Leibovitz's number. Give me the book. I'll look myself for it. You have to get mine glasses. Well, where are your glasses? Look, we can't find six musicians. How do I know where my glasses is? All right, all right. Here, use my glasses. Jimmy. I think somebody should go out and talk to the guests. Tell Uncle Morris to go out and talk to the guests. Uncle Morris has no vest. Well, let me go out and talk to them. You'll stay here, Yetta, before I go crazy. If my tie was tight, sure I, I could go. I... The <laughs> oh, here's the number. Main 2842. Huh. Main 2482. Main 2842. Put it down, please. Oh, all right. Uh, uh. There's a pencil. In the desk. How can I go in the living room with the guests with my tie not tied? Jake, please don't comment about your tie, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yet I call up name 2842 and ask about the musicians. Well, what about the musicians? Ask them why they're not here. Oh, the musicians have been here for five minutes. Say, I could go and talk to the guests. Yeah, and... Come here. Oh, what do you want? Stop everything. I don't care what you're doing. Stop it. And tie, Papa's tie. Okay. Stand still, Pa. All right, all right. I'm standing. <laughs> You're pinching my neck. Well, please stand still for a second or I'll never get it tied. <laughs> there. Hi. Now, Jake, huh? Please go in the front room and talk to the guests. Yeah, but what about Morris's vest? Yes, I'll take the razor blade you cut mine sleeves off it and slice up a little of Uncle Morris' vest. Not so much that he'll fall out of it, but just a little so he'll get into it. Jake, please yeah. go in and talk to the people, huh? Oh, 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 all right, well, Mama. Yeah, look yeah. me over. How do I look? Come here. Oh, it's awful low in front. Well, that's the style. It's like a bathing suit. That's the way it's supposed to be, Ma. Gee, it's beautiful. Yes, yeah, did you fix Uncle Morris' vest? Oh, he got into it. Uh-huh, I know he could do it. But he says he can't eat. Why didn't you cut it, then? Well, he didn't want me to. You go in and cut Uncle Morris' vest. Oh. Right now, he don't care. But when it comes time to eat, it'll be a pink horse from another color. Sarah, turn around. Mm-hmm, beautiful. <laughs> I tell you, all except for the loneliness, it's beautiful. And they... Did the rabbi come yet? He'll be here. Maybe something happened to him. Oh, Ma, don't worry. He'll be here. Ma, I think you should put on your dress. Are the sleeves out? There's Yetta. Yetta, get my dress. And the shoes. The new ones that hoist. All right. Well, if there's nothing for me to do, I'm going to my room and smoke a cigarette. Don't smoke a cigarette with a veil on. I have to have one. Let her have one. She's nervous. If she's nervous, what do you call what I am? I should have a cigar. Yeah, I should have one, too. Yetta, you stay here and help me on with the dress. Hold it now, huh? I thought, well, don't let it touch the floor. Okay, Ma. Now, just step into yeah, it. <coughs> oh, <yeah. coughs> look out. Oh, it's too tight. <laughs> I told him a thousand times it's too tight. Oh, well, wait till I hook it up. Will it be looser after you hook it up? Oh, Ma, stand still for a second. Wait till I take a deep breathe. <sighs> Did you catch it? Once more. <sighs> <sighs> Did you catch it? I got it. Oh. I wish I'd left the sleeves in. I feel naked. Oh, it looks all right. How's the back? Well, turn around. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you better smooth it down. Yeah. Gee. Oh. Yeah, it's well, Ma. Yet I got me the sleeves. You can't wear the three sleeves. Yes, you didn't throw away the sleeves. No, but what are you going to do with them? What am I going to do with them? Tomorrow I'm going to put them back in. Well, now, now listen. Pull, pull it down over your hip. Yeah. For now. Yeah. <laughs> Wait till I get on the shoes. Yet, yeah, did you bring a shoe on? Yeah, here it is. Sit down and I'll put them on for you. Yeah. Uh, the left shoe don't push, remember, I get cones. I'll take it easy with both feet. Uh, did the rabbi come? I don't know. Put your other shoe on. What good is it if the rabbi didn't come? Oh. Oh, you can't have a wedding with shoes. Well, you can't have one without them. Now stand up. Yeah, I guess. Oi, the shoes is too tight, the dress is too tight, everything is too tight. Well, step down in them. Is Sydney here yet? Oh, you have to look and see if Sydney's here. All right. Gee, you look swell in that dress, Ma. I can't breathe in it, let alone heat. Sarah, go over with me everything. The flowers is here. Yes. The food is here. The cakes, too. Well, I haven't seen the wedding cake. You haven't seen the wedding cake? As a matter of fact, I just looked and I know it isn't here. Yes, I... Uh, Sydney ought to 
be here. Call off the bakery. Tell them we didn't order matzos for next Passover. We ordered a wedding cake for today. Oh, the wedding cake's here. I just saw it myself. It just came in. But I can't find Sydney. You've got to find Sydney. Who's she going to marry? The cake? Call up his house. He isn't there. He left ten minutes ago. I tried to call him up myself. He's got to be there. Where do you expect he is? Yes, I take another look, and while you're looking, see if the rabbi's there. Oh, I never saw so much excitement for one wedding. Look for Sydney and don't make wisecracks. I'll call up again, Ma. Well, well, when is going to start? Everyone is here. Jake, did you see the rabbi? Did I see the rabbi? Did I? <laughs> sure. He's putting away his coat. Uh, there's Morris. I got no time to bother with Morris now. Morris's I don't need. Sydney's I need. I... Jake, your tie is untied. Yeah. Somebody did it for a joke. The rabbi's here, but I can't find Sydney. Yes, a tie, Papa's tie. Oh, well, how did it come untied? I just this minute tied it. Papa started chicory already. I can't imagine what's happened to Sydney. What? Sydney's not here? Stand still till I get your tie tied, please, Papa. Yes, huh? hurry up, huh? Ah. I'm hurrying. <laughs> I'll bet you some of his friends played on him a joke. You know, he told me when Irving Shapiro was married, they kidnapped the bridegroom and hid him for two hours. Oi, settle. That's what happened to Sydney. Now the whole wedding is spoiled. He should be here. Didn't you hear what Papa said? He'll be here in two hours. <laughs> Where's Yetta? Yetta? Uh, she went into the other room. I'll get her. Oh, my shoes is killing me. Well, why don't you sit down, Ma? How can I sit down when we got no bridegroom? Sydney just came in. Oh, Sydney just came in. Yeah, he's talking to Papa. You tell your Papa to let Sydney alone. You have to come in. Well, I thought you wanted me to call Pa. I'll call Papa. Jake! Hey, yes, Mama. Did you want me? Jake, stay right by me, huh? Yeah. You have to get Sarah. Yeah. Well, here's the happy bridegroom. Oh, 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 oh. Everything ready? Uh, yeah, there's everything ready. Yeah. Run out and tell the musicians to stop the music and come right back. Yeah, okay. Where's the best man? And here he is. Is everything ready, huh? Jake, Sarah, Sydney. Best man, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Everybody, you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Open the door. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> 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 